Hey, what's up, Eisenhower? I'm Ricardo Frausto. And I'm Victoria Flores, and you're watching the Ike Update Show for Friday, May 5th. Eisenhower has many overlooked classes. Ceramics is one of them. To shed some light, here's Rajay with the story. Ceramics is one of the many classes that you can take after intro to art. There are a few things that set it apart from all other art classes. Ceramics is just an overall really fun class. You get to let your imagination run loose, and you, she gives us a lot of freedom on what we get to do and we can't do. And it's just an overall really fun class for someone who's trying to get into art or is really into art. Anything you work on is guaranteed to be unique because there will never be a project exactly like yours. Ceramics is a real hands-on class that practically anybody can learn. The wheel is the hardest thing you have to do in there. The students say, if you calm down and focus, you will be fine. It's even really different than like drawing and painting or even digital photo. Um, because it's really tactile, you're really using your hands, uh, you're working with elements um, and trying to figure out how long it takes things to dry and what to do to join pieces and the things that you make um, can be taken home and so you have these amazing sculptures and pieces of pottery that you could even use in your home. Everything might not turn out how you would like it, especially working on the wheel. It does take time and effort if you want your project to be good, just like every other class. Come here ready to work and everything should be fine, as long as you're not afraid to get a little messy. Reporting for WDDE TV, I'm Rajay Hudson. If you're interested in actually taking the class, you can see Miss Fennessy with more questions. Your books are almost here. You can pre-order a yearbook today in the main office or in room 138. Once the yearbooks arrive, there is a limited supply, so order now before it's too late. Attention all seniors, exams are approaching fairly quickly. Senior exams will be held on Tuesday, May 16th, Wednesday, May 17th, and Thursday, May 18th. Good luck, seniors. Jolston's will be here for the last time next Tuesday, May 9th, with caps and gowns for $43. There was a catapult event that took place here at Eisenhower, which some of our students participated in. Here's Ricardo with more on the story. Computer-aided drafting is a class in technology and engineering department. In this class, the students learn about engineering and engineering drafting. A big part of the class, they have to make the catapults for the catapult event that took place on April 4th. Uh, the class is uh, Computer-Aided Graphics 449. It's the most advanced of the CAD classes. Um, basically, it's a culmination of all the mechanical CAD that they've learned and we get into engineering, uh, like mechanical engineering, into the class. The students here at CAD use computers to make designs for their catapults to, to determine if they work. Here's Mr. Rivera with the details that bring 3D objects to life. And then they have to use what they've learned in their physics class, what they've learned in this class, combine that together to start making that design in a 3D uh, virtual world. They can test it in the virtual world, assemble it, and then once they figure out that they got something that could work, then they 3D print. As the students got ready for the event, they got onto teams of three to help each other perfect their participating catapults as they try to become the most dominant team. Looking forward to competing against um, multiple schools and uh, showing off our catapult that me and my team made and seeing uh, how ours does against other teams from other schools at Marine. You know, we had to change it a couple times because of uh, design errors and flaws. Had to uh, add stuff that wasn't usually wasn't originally there. For any student that's interested in joining the CAD class, please come see Mr. Rivera at room 104. Reporting from WDDA TV, Ricardo Frausto. You can go see Mr. Rivera at room 104 if you're interested in taking the class. Come out tomorrow for Saturday school to get some extra help in math and English. Today is a deadline for NHS applications. Please turn in your form at room 119. That's all for today's show. Thanks for watching.